Hey everybody, it's me, Wildman Beats here, and this is going to be episode 25 of Greedfall. As we're uh, trying to figure out what's going on between the Inquisitors and the Knots. Seems like the Inquisitors have something big planned, so we're going to have to speak to the Queen of San Mateus. So, uh, thank you for coming to watch this video, and I hope you enjoy. Otherwise, let's get into it. And we're in. And apparently, where I've killed some people. I don't know what happened there. But let's head over to find proof against the Ordo Luminous. Um, how do I get there? Straight and then right? Oh, but I'm gonna have to go a bit of a roundabout way. This works though. Oh, this worked. And look, some loot. Is there another way? I guess it really is. Oh, there is an alleyway there. Oh, oh, but that that leads over this way too. So outside the coin tavern is kind of a crappy spot for getting over here. All right, and here's the order. And I have uh, priest ropes. So I can disguise myself maybe. Find proof. Well, we found proof for something in here at, uh, at one point. Uh, not this time though. Man, Bosco looks so dorky in these. <laughs> Kurt looks like he should in those, though. Anything in here? Uh, what about it? Ooh, some blood. No evidence, though. Order luminous quarters. Oh shit! That ought to get him. Level up. My bad. I didn't mean to come in here and start killing people. That was quite a surprise. And here we are. So I guess I had to come up here. Message from the Inquisitor Bishop Domitius. Domitius? Domitius? The purification of the knots will begin as soon as those we have in our jails will have confessed. We'll have enough proof. Then to convince the Mother Cardinal to let us act. It's high time we eliminated these heretics who have been allowed to circulate our cities freely. Until then, stay discreet. We would be in a delicate situation if our plan were to be revealed too early. We must meet with the Mother Cardinal urgently. Only mm -hmm. she can put an end to this mad. And I've got to level up. Two skill points and one attribute point. Uh, let's see here. What looks good? Hmm. These are all the bulwark abilities. Nah. These are all healing. Hmm. Whatever. I guess I go healing. Do I? Bomb? Does that cost mana? 
Or do you craft it? You might craft it. Oh, wait. It costs your fury. Furious cost. Hmm. What about two-handed heavy? I could start leveling up heavy. Or shield of enlightened. Maybe shield is best. Because the healing gives armor. But... I don't know. I'll probably not use it that much, but... Maybe. Uh, and I should probably level up willpower. I could get that last mental power, but I think willpower. Um, getting that to level three. Is a little better. Allow me to get a better amulet. More magic regeneration during the fights. More spells equals more damage. Hey, no one's here to stop me this time. Go straight to the Mother Cardinal. This place is spooky. I don't think any, like, factions in games scare me more than religious fanatics. They're so unhinged. They've got, like, propaganda, manipulation of their people. Like, they're usually the most, like... Bad to their people, you know, right? But they get the most support from them because they're brainwashed. Bishop Dimitius. Yes? I would like to have an audience with the Mother Cardinal to discuss the discoveries made during our investigation. What is this about, Dimitius? Well, I don't rightly know. Yeah, you do. Um, speak of the project to attack the port, speak of the discoveries in the reserve. I caught wind of a ridiculous scheme planned for the port by the Ordo Luminous, and I wanted to clear it up. I was able to get my hand on documents that effectively detailed an attack, a great purification. They were signed by you, Father, and included a contract where you enlisted the assistance of the coin guard to attack every Nort building and make prisoner of every one of their men that could be taken alive. Domitius, how could you? Whatever did you want to accomplish? The Norts are not believers. We should not be dependent on heretics. Aye, Have you gone aye, completely aye. mad, Domitius? We are on an island. How could we not be dependent on the Norts? I want them arrested. Him and every member of his order. I will decide at a later time their fate. I thank you for bringing this business to my attention. Going after the Norts. What madness. Without you, this city would now be drowning in chaos. Carry my best wishes to your cousin. His desire to maintain the peace on the island honors his house's reputation. I will tell him, Your Eminence. Until we meet again. Wow, so she's gonna imprison everyone in the Ordo Luminous? Dude. That was sick. Now I feel bad though, because it makes me want to help the lady, because she's actually good, but... What kind of, like, empire does she run if that's what's going on under her nose? Like, she's got nobody. No power. I mean, she has the power to put him away, I guess. So, actually, she does have some power, but... Like... No oversight. Alright, so now... We can... Go back to the Admiral in New Serene. I 
corridors are along here somewhere, right? Is it? This is them. Yep. Okay. Hi, Siora. All right, new serene. Let's go. Port quarter. It'll only take a moment. All right, because I did it too quickly, it's still loading the next zone, right? I forgot that that's the point of that whole center area is to let it, you do something while it loads. Desarde, what can I do for you? We got your your extremists. I've settled the problem in San Mateus. Several of your men were imprisoned by the Ordo Luminous. The misguided brothers planned to attack the port. I had them arrested. They should no longer be a threat to you. The Order thought you to be heretics because of your tradition of secrecy. The secrets. They often cut both ways. Therefore, I'm going to reveal to you another. Uh -oh. We discovered this island nearly two centuries ago. A few decades later, we sold the discovery to your nation of merchants. Then, our closest allies, we transported some lords, men, oh. and merchandise. They began to colonize the island. The lords revealed themselves to possess a tyrannical nature and began to exploit the lands with a deadly passion. Their actions provoked a revolt of the natives, but also the very workers and craftsmen they had brought with them. The magic of the natives of Tirfredi was awoken. Beasts came out of the woods and destroyed the new cities. Only a handful of lords and armed men were able to make it back to our ships. The losses were enormous. The humiliation, devastating. Your princes paid us well to keep their secret. They continued to make the occasional expedition. You are in fact a product of one of them. What are you oh. saying? You must have had your doubts. You are the child of a native. You were born on one of our ships. The child of an islander? But I know who my mother is and... I understand how difficult this is to hear. And I wouldn't know why your family has kept this from you all this time. In the end, we decided to sell the secret location of the island to other nations. The congregation, in spite of its fears, could not keep away. Oh boy. And here you are again. I am sorry for the shock I have caused you. You asked me for the truth, and now you have it. Anything else? That's it. I need to be going. Until we meet again, Admiral. I can't believe it. That for all this time, I've been fed lies. Did Constantine know? I must... I must go and see him. I am sorry, Greenblood. I promise you that I knew nothing of it. And as far as I'm concerned, this changes nothing. I will keep watching over you. So I'm not actually their son. Or... Uh, other option is my dad, you know, didn't actually have it with my mother. He had it with a native. Hmm. I don't know. I think I prefer the adoption <laughs> uh, scenario. Let's see what Constantine knows though. You couldn't pick a better time. I've been taken with jitters like a cat on a midday roof. <laughs> what are you waiting for with such anticipation? I took your advice, you see? I've summoned one of these crows! Oh. He has been examining me for nearly an hour. I just barely escaped a purge. But I was given the mandatory bleeding. I so hate their little knives. And so then, our venerable doctor, what is the verdict? Blood is black. <gasps> Constantine, is this your blood? Constantine, answer me. Constantine, 
Stay with me. Concentrate. There is a chance that he is in error. It might be something else. I'm going to die. No. Oh, shit. No, Constantine. I will die. Like your mother. And the others. On the continent. I... I'm dying. I don't want to die. I don't. No, no, not so soon. It's so good. Cousin, I, I don't want... Constantine, I'm here. Pull yourself together. Out. Everyone out. It's in order. Oh, shit. Thank you. Cousin, there now. Are you better? I don't know. You won't leave me, will you? I'm going to find a cure, I promise you. Didn't you promise the same thing to your mother? You know I'll be dead before you find one. Don't say that. I will succeed. I've already some promising trails to explore. I don't know, cousin. The tidings are so awfully dire. I'm afraid. <laughs> so afraid. Oh boy. I doubt the reason for your visit was to console me in my tragedy. Tell me, what brings you here? It can wait. It's nothing that can't be dealt with later. But please, please, whatever it is, it will take my mind elsewhere. I was uh. able to get the whole story out of the Admiral in exchange for a service. As our investigation was leading us to imagine, the congregation did once attempt to colonize the island. The Norts discovered it some two centuries ago and brought our people here a few decades later. But the enterprise to colonize the island failed completely. There were a great many bloody battles. Few colonists survived. The princes preferred to hide their defeat and paid the Norts to keep the secret. That they hid the fiasco from the world, I get. But that my father said nothing about it to me. That's not the most shocking part of the story, believe me. What do you mean? The congregation continued to make expeditions to the island with the help of the Norts. According to the Admiral, my mother came from the island and was brought back. I was born on one of their ships. What? But... That means you are not your dear cousin? No. All the lies we've been fed since our tender childhood. The fable told that I'm the spitting image of my dead father lost during an expedition. God, I, I don't know what to think, Constantine. Why did they do that to me? I don't know. It's another one of their sly and dark orchestrations. Some vile intrigue. If it is of some comfort, no matter the true story, you will always be my dear cousin. You have always been the only one to care for me. You are my only friend. That's all that matters to me. Keep this discovery between us. No one needs to know. My aunt adopted you after all. Bring in the others. Let us speak of different concerns. That's enough bad news for one day. It's a lot of bad news. Who is this? Is that Kurt? Kurt? What is... Dismissed, soldiers! Leave us. We have much to say. What, what is going on? I don't appreciate this attitude, Kurt. Must I remind you that these men all answer to me? Times change, your highness. Or rather, they're about to do so. Is that a threat? What are you hoping to accomplish? What is don't Kurt tell doing? Silence. We have little time and not to lose. Kurt, what are you talking about? The commander of the Coin Guard is here in New Serene at this very moment. He's preparing a coup d'etat. In the three cities of the island, our men are going to eliminate the governors and their entourage. This is madness. What? How? How? You'll go down as easy as plum pie and cherry wine. Standing behind every one of you is one of our men. You have entrusted us with your security. You are completely at our mercy. Then why did you send your men away? And why are you telling us all of this? Because he doesn't I've want it to happen. I've known you both for a very long time. Too long. I've come to know you. To respect you. And I've never reneged on a contract. These orders go against all that I am. A cold-hearted mercenary. Definitely. But never a traitor. 
And so now you are forewarned. You must take action. Thank you, Kurt. I will not forget this. Constantine, we need to get you to safety as well as your count. But I want to... What? Take part? You can barely stand up. No. We must take you into the cellar. If I've completely understood what you've said, Kurt, the governors of our cities are also in danger. Yes. Yep. If you want to keep your allies, Your Highness, you also need to warn them. Correct. We cannot let them fall into the hands of these traitors. I will find the means to send them a messenger. Do you know where to find your conspirators? It would seem I should be one of them. They are counting on me to eliminate both of you. The most urgent matter is to get our hands on the commander and his three lieutenants. The others are doing nothing but following orders. If we cut off the heads, they will fall into rank. <sighs> I always knew you were... Don't make me change my mind. We better what be in off. the world? Now. Okay, see, the problem with this is... We helped Kurt find out. But he's acting like, oh, I just decided I'm going to be good to you guys and help you. It's like, no, we, we discovered this together. It's like they wrote the story, you know, to make it so that whether or not you did that quest, it would happen this way, that it wouldn't change no matter what happened, which is a, a little bit disappointing. Vasco and Kurt, you're coming with me. We'll certainly have to fight some traitors at Torsten's behest on our way to the cellar. Stay on your guard. Stay behind us, Constantine. You're in no condition to fight. We must also think about the advisors, including your professor. And then we have to rescue Lady Mirage. Oh, we Lady must Mirage. hurry before the guard can act. Is this the guard right here? <laughs> Um, so where are we? Oh, upstairs. My bad. Oops. So we have to go up. Up these stairs first. And then take a right and a left. Lord de Cossillon! The coin guard tried to assassinate my cousin and is plotting the same actions against the other governors. So they have finally done it. Such proximity to power is a terrible temptation. It was only a question of time before they succumbed. We should have paid more attention to your lessons. We might have been able to avoid all of this. Follow me. I'm taking you somewhere safe. I'm coming. Okay, we got him. Oh, okay. Ow. Man, they gave me nowhere to go. Like they were right outside. Okay, where do we need to go now? Back downstairs. Oh. Well, this is in the way. This way? Yeah, okay. 
to my help. And death to the others. Ow. Move away. Things are about to get. All right. Take a potion. So these are both downstairs. Go up, go up, go down, go down. here go up okay or wait oh no i just need to take a right go over here lord minister the coin guard wants to take control of the island by assassinating all its governors the guard is everywhere they could succeed we will do everything in our power to thwart them come now We'll take you somewhere safe. I'll follow you. Okay. Oh, shit. Excuse me. Gotta loot. All right, next place. We need to go down here and take a left. Oh, loot. Is this right? No. Oh, there's a door behind me though. I'm stronger. Sorry. I'm overweight. I can't sprint. You're kidding me. Uh, can I drop a priest robe? I need 20. I'm over by 22 weapons. I've got some crappy worn spike maze. Drop. 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 That should do it. Oh, that's not the right way. Oh shit. We've reached the cellar. It looks like a good place to hide. Constantine, promise me that you will stay here until we secure the city. Do I even have a choice? Here I am consigned to my quarters like some broken old maid. Like someone ill, Constantine. Someone sick who is dear to me and the city wouldn't survive your loss. You have such a way with words. Very well. I promise to stay here, obediently awaiting your return. Let's go then. And cousin, watch out for yourself. You were dear to me as well. You are safe here. You have my eternal gratitude, Excellency. We owe you our lives. You will be safe here. Thank you, my friend. I will never forget what you've done for me. All right. But we still have to get Lady Mirange and warn the other governors. Well, 
Let's go. Oh, oh, that was, that was Kurt. It made me jump. All right, Lady Mirage and Warren Governors. There's gonna be no guards in the city, though. Lady Morange, make ready to depart. We cannot remain here. But what is going on? The coin guard has decided to take control of the isle. They plan to overthrow the governors. They were set on assassinating Constantine and his entire entourage. The idiots! You are in danger. Do you know a safe place where we could take you? Don't worry about me. I have friends here. They will hide me. Go! And do be careful. I hope she is correct. Ooh, purple helmet. Okay, I can't run. But there's a merchant place close. If I can just get there, we can sell off some of this crap. Oh, Manawi. You won't sell to me. You always sell to me. What about you, Mr. Blacksmith? There we go. It's a great pleasure to see you again at the forge. What can I do for you? I need to sell. Actually, before we do that, make sure I don't have a better weapon for Kurt. Which, oh, you can use this 360. Okay. Okay. Kurt's going to be hitting hard. And this slight flamberge 264 might not actually be the best thing for him anymore. Uh, no, it is. Okay. Everything's just a little bit worse. Oh, it's a great pleasure to... a lot of stuff okay and we have to see about helmets bounce bassinet he's already wearing one bosco doesn't have the endurance for one they can wear this uh what about Torso armor. Old stuff. Oh, that one's strong. 104. Oh, 120 for this one. Jeez. Okay. Vosco. That means. Oh, Vosco's is. Oh, right. He's wearing that thing. But it looks so hideous. What if I put him in in this? It's only two worse. It's got better balance. Actually, yeah, we'll, we'll put him in this. And what about gloves? Any? Nah, not really. What about? Oh, for me? No, I can't wear them. Don't have the endurance. Okay, gloves, they are fine. Boots, they could use new boots, maybe. Hmm. Nope. Oh, right, I've got my warrior pantaloons. Those are the best thing there. He's got second commands cuses. Those are pretty good. 
And what about necklace stuff? Nah. Oh, firearm. Whoa. Whoa, okay. I can equip a gun. I'm not good enough with any. Okay, and now oh, let's sell. It's a great play. Got a lot of armor to sell. Uh, Blanche bassinet. I should keep those around. Those are really good. Old Teleme War armor. I don't think I'm keeping it around. Gloves. Let's sell off these gloves. Keep the gloves, the goldsmith ones. Boots, sell off all the boots. All right, that brought me down to 129. It's pretty good, and a lot of it is probably in these helmets and these armors. The best. Let's oh. see if. Bye. Do you have any? Oh, only blue. What about armor. Really? Wait. The only stuff he's selling is what I sold him. What kind of deal is this? What is oh. Okay, craft me a ring. Uh, what I can't tell him to craft like something. Oh, well. Oh, jeez. Oh, I got shot. All right, they're down so we can tell this dude messenger be ready to leave at once you must warn the governor of Hikmet that a conspiracy is underway targeting him uh, it, it's just that I, I can't leave the city just yet why what are you talking about the order comes from the governor what more do you need uh, it, it's, it's just that I, I was told if I left the city today it, it would cost me my life who said that? The commander's men, I suppose. Uh, I don't really know. But they were heavily armed and they pay very well. Um, let's bribe them. If it's a question of money, how much did they prop? A lot, my lord. You should be ashamed of your cupidity. Here, this should do it. Well? Ah, uh, your excellency is extremely generous. Oh, I should leave immediately. Whatever. Bribes are easy. I've got the money. Oh, shit. Oh, right. This is the coin guard barracks. Of course it's gonna... Oh, but I have to. Well, I mean, I could go around, but this will be cooler. And kaboom, dude, they got decimated. And I'll do another one. <laughs> oh, baby. Oh, I am too strong. Still wearing my looting outfit. No armor, only loot. Now is not the time. No, I'm just trying to... Just want to loot. And I got a... What was that? Great. Holy shit. 
It's quite the axe. Uh, I don't think any of us can actually wield it. And you. Make preparations to leave. I have a message to communicate immediately to the governor of San Mateus. You must tell the mother cardinal that the coin guard is preparing a coup d'etat. Her life and those of her entourage are in grave danger. Very well, your excellency. I'll leave immediately. The oh, okay. Don't have to argue with him. Is preparing the attack. We should try to reach him discreetly. We could try to go through the tavern's kitchen. That's one way to do it. Or we could use the scaffolding to access the upper floor directly. But it's visible from the dormitories. And I know that the young recruits were ordered to stay there. They will not suspect us if we're wearing guard uniforms. Do you know where the three lieutenants you told us about are located? Ludger is an instructor. He'll be in the right wing of the barracks. As for the other two, they'll be at the tavern. Olga and Werner are in charge of the guards... Uh, secondary activities. In the basement. I see. Our priority should still be to stop Torsten. We'll worry about the others later. I have to get a guard outfit. I think I had some in in the chest back home. Let me go get those. I didn't bring him along with me. Okay. Inventory. Let's deposit my stuff. Discover's hat. Honestly, I don't need this, do I? Ooh, worn steel gauntlets. Those are good. Study. Oh, those are good too. Okay, let's see what we got in here. Major's collar display. Right, I can't wear that. This is coin guard stuff, right? Blues, or is it? No, I think just this. Wait, why is my inventory still so full? I, did I not put my stuff in, in here? Oh, I didn't. Oh, I could. Oh, I didn't have the endurance to wear that. Okay. Never mind. And I can't wear that. And I'll put these in. These in. Oh, wait. No, I wanted those boots. Dang it. Okay. And you can wear these babies, Kurt. Hmm, didn't I have gloves? Yeah, you get some nice gloves. Look at that. Oh, and I didn't put on my new armor. Still like my pants. Okay, let's take the scaffolding. I did at one point on accident, remember? Ended up inside the guard thing because of going up in here. It was like in the very beginning, just exploring the city. Soldiers! Captain! We have a message for the commander. Where is your instructor? They are both in the officer's hall, Captain. On the other side of the landing, on this floor. Very well. At ease, soldier. 
Okay. Right here. We're in his office. Oh, that's not right. Or is it? Oh, never mind. It is. Okay. We take a right here. Yep. What are you doing here, recruits? Return to your barracks. You have your orders. Sorry, Lieutenant, but I'm afraid we cannot follow those orders. You are under arrest, as well as your commander. But what is this? I recognize you. You're the governor's emissary. And Kurt, you had your orders. Sorry, but forced to betray someone, I decided it would be the less likable of the lot. Traitor. Soldiers, ready weapons. Oh, you're gonna do it this way, huh? And they go down like flies. What is this? Oh, level two. Yeah, I can't do that. Oh, another. Now the commander should be right in here. Do you know where Torsten could have gone? No. But we'll certainly find some information about it in these papers. All right. Commander, we have carefully followed your instructions and in the operation were... If the operation were to fail, an escort will be waiting for you outside the barracks to take you to safely to the docks, where the not ship you've asked for will be waiting for you. For you, ready to depart, Lieutenant Werner. Torsten suspected that I would denounce him, and he was prepared to leave this place. We must catch up to him. He cannot get away with this. Let's go. Torsten is a snake, but he's clever. Apparently, he suspected I would refuse. We gotta go. The guard, we're moving out. Break camp. We are no Whoa. longer welcome here. And so, these snake oil merchants defy us by sending their watchdog. Let's show them what guards are made of. Okay. I don't know if that's what you want. <laughs> here, you pathetic dog! The game is over for you, Commander. Kill him. <gasps> we only locked him up, huh? Wait. I didn't arrest the lieutenants. We gotta go back. Okay. Speed run, speed run, speed run. Shit. We've arrived too late. Do you know where Torsten could have Already gone? read it. No. But we'll certainly find some information about it in these. We papers. need to head to the tavern first. Torsten suspected that I would denounce him, and he was prepared to leave this place. We must catch up to him. He cannot get away with this. Let's go. a snake but he's clever apparently he suspected i would refuse to follow his orders he must have been told about okay our where do you the think the tavern is drew his own conclusions he knew you better than you thought he did where would it be move Ah, here we are.
Oh, I'm sorry, come on. Your Excellency. I know you've paid your entry fee, but this is a special night. My orders are not to let anyone in. Let me in. What if I paid you a supplement for your good services? Very well, you can come in. I hope I won't be in trouble. You're going down. I regret, my lord. We are closed this evening. Come back another day. I'm not here to tempt my luck. Are you in charge? That's right. What do you want from me? You're under arrest. You. Nothing. We are here to arrest the commander's lieutenants. Is that right? Now, this ought to be good. And for what crime would that be? You know Conspiracy. very well. For high treason. Oh, and you think that my men are just gonna let you without so much as blinking an eye? Tempt reasoning. Why would your men risk their lives and their families' well being to serve your greedy ambitions? Gentlemen, you have been manipulated. I imagine you were promised riches and high station on the island. Told that with such a prize you would be free of the services of the merchants, the mages and the scholars. But do you imagine for an instant that the noughts would risk losing their precious clients for you? That the continental nations that you've betrayed would accept that you might return to their lands? You would be condemned to remain on this island, isolated and forever banished from the continent. I only hope that you are leaving no one behind you, because you will never see them again. You make sense. We have too much to lose in this story. I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but you're gonna have to deal with this yourself. Do with him what you feel you must. Oh. That'll do it. And there's one more in here. Soldiers! Ready weapons! We are under attack! We have been sent by the governor, Constantine Dorsey. Convinced. Your lieutenant is accused of high treason for having participated in an attempted coup d'etat. As you can see for yourselves, the attempt failed. Are you also ready to be accused of treason because of your loyalty to your lieutenant? I doubt it. Success. I'm sure they're going to make the wise decision. Isn't that right, Dieter? You give your word that we'll suffer no repercussions if we lay down arms. You have my word. Very well. We are dropping our weapons, soldiers. That dog's hide doesn't deserve our sacrifice. To my help. Oh. This is... I thought he was a lieutenant. All right. Now we have to go and catch the main man again. I know we already did once, but... <laughs> No, it won't be too hard. Oh, but because I took the time to do that, he got further away. Oh, shit. I didn't think about that. <gasps> we failed? Howard has escaped. No way. No way, dude. Holy shit. Okay, I fucked that up. That's my bad. And I quick save, so there's no going back. He's at. Oh, I really fucked that up. Oops. Assess the situation with Constantin. I fucked up. Had him in the first time, and then I realized I didn't do everything I was supposed to. I thought I was supposed to arrest the lieutenants, too. Well. That sucks. Well, 
Wait. Upstairs? I thought he was supposed to be in the cellar. He went back up in here? Time to return and see those dear to me. <gasps> no. Oh shit. Const how are you feeling? <laughs> Death is on my doorstep, and all hope has flown through the window. Come closer. <laughs> what ill tidings do you bring? He escaped. Yes. I thought you'd like to know that the coin guard's attempt to take control of the island has failed. <sighs> this is excellent news. The kind I've not had in a great while. Thank you, Kurt. Were it not for your loyalty, we were lost. As for you, my dear cousin, <sighs> you know what I owe you. Not only have you looked out for me, like always, but you have protected my advisors. Yes. And if your highness would permit, I would like to relay our most sincere gratitude from all of Teleme. Thanks to your message, the Mother Cardinal was able to thwart the Commander's plans. By the nice. grace of the Illuminated, the city is saved, and the traitors punished as they should be. Alas, the instigator of all this tragedy slipped through my fingers. I was yeah. informed that the Commander was able to leave the island. I wish him luck in finding a port that... And you were able to catch his lieutenants. The squires will pay for the crimes of their masters. As happens too often. Enough talk of ruffians. They failed. And for that, I again thank Kurt. If your highness is looking for a means to translate his gratitude, gold is a present that is always appreciated. I imagine huh. that you okay. should name a new commander. Yes. I will discuss the matter with loyalist officers, but I think I know who will be elected. I hope it is someone whom we can trust. We do need soldiers, but loyal soldiers above all. We are well aware that the guard's reputation has been tarnished. We will not make the same mistake twice. Sieglinda is solid and loyal. Right, Sieglinda. I beside her. You have my complete trust, Kurt. You have amply earned it before you leave. I must ask you something. All right, I'm listening. I'm always suffering, cousin. I'm in such terrible pain and we're yet to discover a cure. I'm sorry. I fully intend to continue my research. We have a number of leads, but with all that's been happening, don't blame yourself. I know how much you do. Yet, I'm afraid that before the sickness claims me, the pain will have driven me mad. If only there was a way to ease my suffering. I know of a healer with powers that are legendary oh, amongst the clans. Siora. It is rumored he can alleviate even the most terrible pains. His village is west of the city. I could take you there. One of our holy men lives in San Mateus. His healing powers are supposedly miraculous. Alas, it is a miracle we are in need of, my son. I'm nothing more than a sailor. I don't have much to offer when it comes to healing. As it would seem to lay me a prey for the Malachor, just like the Bridge Alliance, perhaps it would be best to ask for aid from those not suffering from the plague. The sailor's right. The holy men and the sages had their chance on the continent, and we all know how that went. Thank you, as always, for your advice. Cousin, you are the only one I trust, so please, don't let me lose my mind. I'll follow the leads and find a way. I won't let you down. Hold on. I'll be back as soon as I can. What if this is like a thing where for all of the side quests I did, it caused him to go further down the blood plague. Like if you do less quests, he does better. You know, what if it's something like that? That would be very interesting. I'm not sure that that's how it is, but... I mean, we just saw how in a quest where I do too many of the optional things and it actually fucks up the main objective. So I ran out of time to capture the, the chief. 
anyway that is where we're gonna leave it for episode 25 so thank you so much for coming to watch this episode this one was action packed this had a lot of stuff so hope you enjoyed and as always have a great day